Shiloh Christian quarterback Eli Wisdom remembers the pain of last year's state title game defeat. Seeing the upperclassmen, you know, go out the field, cry for the very last time, and not and not cry in a joyful way, but kind of like a sad way, like, dang, I'm, I'm done, and we just got our butts kicked. That's, that's something that I don't want to um, have to deal with, and I kind of want to leave um, a legacy at Shiloh um, with a, a win. Shiloh is looking for a third straight trip to Little Rock this year, but for the first time, looking to do it in the 5A. That move up in competition hasn't stopped the Saints from going 7-1 so far, including 5-0 in conference play. At the heart of it all, third-year starter Eli Wisdom. We really try to strive to, to be great with our leadership, our decision making and our accuracy. And I really feel like he's done that as well as anyone that has ever come through here. And while Wisdom does make plays with his arm, it's his ability to be equally dangerous with his legs that burns opposing defenses. God gave me legs to run. And so when I have a chance to run, I'm gonna go run. There's very few that, that have done what he has done. Uh, when you think about in a career throwing for 7,000 yards and rushing for 3,000 yards, there's only been one other guy in the history of Arkansas that has done that. Despite maybe being considered small for the position, listed at six foot tall, that hasn't stopped Wisdom from putting up those big numbers. I get you know a lot of overlooks from either colleges or people, um, and so I think that's a motivation for me. And, um, just seeing um, people like Kyler Murray or Johnny Manziel, people like that kind of play um, that style as a 5'10", 5'11 quarterback um, is kind of you know, an in inspiration um, and that it can be done. And in looking to get back to Little Rock, Wisdom has helped to inspire those on his team as well. I think now he's, he's doing a, a very good job of making that contagious on our team. And I think others have upped their game because they've watched the way he's gone about upping his. Reporting in Springdale, Jonathan Acosta, 5 News Sports.